What up, y'all? Welcome back. We're Cuban. What up, big peeps? Vape Nation. What are we? What are we getting here? What's the pickerooski? Well, I do like big ghouls. Big ghouls is good. Yes, there's big ghouls up. Is it just big ghouls? Uh, I have a few issues with the cube, but all in all, I'm still having a good time with it, so it's fine. Could take this mom and go mono white. I think it's big ghouls. I think it's the strongest card in this pack. Good play. Thank you so much, man. Nine months in a row. That is awesome. Take the alien, make it an extraterrestrial stream. Deal. Oh, look at these back-to-back -back swords in this pack. Hmm. Back-to-back -back swords in this pack. At the bad Elspeth? Uh, yes. Okay. Yes. I create compelling connections with my compelling narratives. Yeah, that sounds like a... Put that on your resume. When was the last time you checked Twitter? It was I sent you a funny message there probably three months ago. I have been off Twitter for a while. I could Nissa? check it, but what? Nissa? You think it's Nissa? I was thinking Nissa or like Counterspell. I think it is Nissa, actually. She's very good. All right, I'll take a Nissa. Oh, a Thrag Daddy. That's a good Gideon. Gary. Good, good Giddy. We can do a Gary. Go all in on mono black already. Yeah, third pick mono black. Hmm. This guy fits. He, well, not exactly. Yeah, he does. He's mono black. Okay. Could just be Tusky. Tuscarino. Tusky Busky. Tusky McBusky. He's a husky boy. He is a husky boy. I'll take it. Sure. All right, I'm take it. Oh, nickel bolus done. Well, I don't know if that's correct. <laughs> it's probably this guy, right? Uh, over Green Sunzia? Probably. I could see a Green Sunzina. Green Sunzina is probably better, actually. You're right. Green Sun is a mana dork, and it's also so much more. I like a Green Sun. I'll take a Green Sun. Yeah, Green Sun. Oh, Green Soul Ring? We're doing it. One. We're living the Olamog dream, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, this isn't a close pick. I'm just waiting a second to give you guys a chance to look at this pack. We're going to take the green soul ring. Yeah. Yeah. Everything's coming yeah. up green, ladies and gentlemen. I can hear the YouTube comments now. You got He always drafts green. Oh, I like wood elves, actually. Would you? Would I what? Elves. Would I elves? Mm-hmm. Would I elves what? Mm-hmm. All right, we're done. Yes. Okay. Yes. Oh, my God. Uh, yes. Why is he doing it? Yes. <laughs> I can't. Yes. Oh, God. It's any forest, by the way, so... Right, so you get the you can get breeding pool, you can get a <laughs> Come on. Let's open a natural order. Oh, we got a search for tomorrow and a Lodi Cobra? I think it's search. You think it's search over Lodi Cobra? Yeah, we don't have any fetch lands. We have regular lands. Those aren't as good. Aren't they better? No. Aren't you better? No. Hmm. KGX Reload, thank you so much for the three months up. I really appreciate it. You are awesome. Welcome back. Which one is it? This guy? This guy? This guy? This guy? I think it's Cobra. I think you're a dummy. We can also green sun no. for a Cobra. Eh. I don't care. I vetoed your decision. <sighs> terrible. You're terrible. Okay, so we, me and Mike were actually talking about the slap mic stipulation, and we were talking about what's a fair amount, what's a fair donation goal to get to for Mike? Mike would get it for us to do a slap donate for a do, to do a slap stipulation. I'm very curious. 
Does that ice have something special in tonight, Mitchell? You a wild boy tonight. <laughs> oh, God. Wow, we got five cents, two bits, two fifty, about tree fifty. Okay, well, oh, there it is. Oh, this guy's great. This guy's always been great, right? Yeah. I'm sorry. What? Yeah. Okay. Thousand dollars. All right. So Mitchell, the slap stipulation is whenever I take damage, Mike gets slapped for every point of damage we take. Really? Really? I mean, I'll take it, because I don't think Virtuous Gearhulk is better than the sword. hundred fifty sounds reasonable. Do we do a whole draft, though? Because that's like... That could be nine rounds of slapping. And if we take 20 damage every round... Like, how much is that? Uh, 20 times 9. 180 slaps. That's a lot. Oh, I like a beast within. Your command definitely shouldn't be disabled. Oh, it looks like MTG bot is not in the chat though. That's weird. Let's fix that. Oh, Finhorn Elves came back. A. Wow, that's weird. All right, hold on. Let me add MTG bot to the chat. I don't know why it's not. Hey, it might be down. MTG bot might be down right now. Oh, just as usual, we get all the things. Wow, even fertile ground. That was the other card I was deciding between. All right, and we'll just open this for fellows, I guess. Oh, these green decks, man. Wow. I guess no one likes green in this cube. Yeah, it looks like MTG Bot is just down right now. I think 500 is a fair price, but we won't get there. Actually, Mike said five. Mike was like, I was like, Mike said 100, and I was like, that seems really easy. And he's like, oh, maybe I should have said 1,000. And I'm like, I think that seems a little bit much. And he's like, how about 500? And I was like, I don't know. What are you taking here? Probably Pilgrim. Over the Garrick? I think I bet, so. I bet this Garrick comes back anyway. Probably. Dr. Armadillo, PhD. What's going on, buddy? No, we're definitely sticking to 40. We're not doing another 60. We already played that. We already played that, uh, that game. That game didn't go too well. It did not. I am not a Tangle Wire fan. Dude... Crew away from the mic? Is Are you crewing in the mic again? Crewing? I think it's just Bird of Paradise. Because there's literally nothing else in this pack. And now I wish we didn't take that pill. All blanks. Oh, there we go. That's a spicy boy. I have a feeling Nyctos will come back before uh, Bird of Paradise or Avacyn's Pilgrim do. Definitely Oracle here. Hornet Queen. Actually, Hornet Queen is perfect. This gives you, like, removal for flying things that you might not have otherwise. Plus, we have Tooth and Nail and Green Sun Zenith. That's actually really good. Hmm. What do you think? Time Warp. I was actually thinking of Time Warp. We have no way to cast it other than Birds of Paradise and, like, <gasps> Fertile Ground. That's all I need. Zaxor, I will 100% do a birthday stipulation for you, buddy. What's the pick here? I don't even know. 
Just Edric? Genesis wave? I don't think we need wave. Edric. Two cards are coming back from this pack. I don't think I don't think one of them is going to be Edric. I will take the Edric though because that might be playable, especially when we have uh, Wood Elves. If we get a Breeding Pool or another thing, we could also search for Edric at the Green Sun Zenith. We have a Bird of Paradise and a Fertile Ground and a Lotus Cobra, so we actually have a, quite a few ways to cast an Edric. Uh, significantly fewer ways to cast a Time Warp with Double Blue. Oh God! How do we always get the Primeval Titan? I ain't gonna complain. I mean, it's better than all these other green cards, right? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And, like, not close, really, right? Mm-mm. I like a battlement. Yeah. I mean, we're already at 23 cards now, so I guess we're good. This guy's good. Mm hmm. Hmm. I don't hate Dromoka's command, though. Being able to fight something or uh, make a sacrifice an enchantment. What do you think? Green Warden or Dromoka's command? Dromoka's command seems fine. I like the command. Oh, yep. All right. So just just to be well, there's clear, a, there's a temple garden though. That's actually not bad with the wood elves. Mm -hmm. Let's just play this easier. Yeah, I'll take temple garden. I can get behind that. Nykthos comes back. Okay. Journey to Nyx. This guy's actually pretty good for us. If we're splashing white, or yeah, I don't think we care about explore. Nah. Oh boy, that's a good that's a good Sally. Is his name Sally? Yes. Huh. What's going on, Mitchell? Nope. Yep. Nope. What do you think, man? Let's pick. There's a ramp of growth. Over Karn, Daddy? Maybe not. Why are you the way that you are? You cutting a one drop? What's wrong with you? I don't know what you? I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just trying to figure out what we're cutting because we already have 25 cards. It's gotta be Karn, dude. That rampant growth will come back and you know it. I don't know anything. Yeah, I know. Hmm. Thicket. Or over, over catacomb? Catacomb is probably better. Catacomb is just a thicket that thins your deck and also gets you the white source that comes in play untapped. Yeah, I think it's Catacomb. We actually have enough playables here. God. God. Yeah. Glenn Royals. I guess, but do we really need that? Who knows? I'm just making up songs as I go. Or what are we picking, man? Let's pick. I don't know. I'll take mine, so. Really? I feel like we have enough ramp. Literally, this is four ramp spells. This is four ramp spells. These are two rampy spells. Okay. So I just, I, I'd rather just have the Garuk because it does something different. There's Dromoka. Yeah. 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 Gilded Lotus. Also, this is probably a 16 land deck, right? I think so. I can't imagine playing 17 lands in this deck. 
Maybe we cut the oolong too. What? Okay, do oolong come back. She crazy. I like Dramoka. How do you feel about Dramoka? Sounds delicious. Okay. It's the. Ancient tomb? Pretty powerful. Is it? Mm hmm. It's like a soaring land. It's real painful, though. Yeah. I was thinking Noble Hierarch or Solemn Simulacrum. Oh. I really injured my toe earlier. Are you still messed up about that? Yeah. It's painful. God. Don't kick things. Kids. You think it's Ancient Tomb? Yeah. You want to just try Ancient Tomb out? Mm hmm. All right. Ancient Tomb it is. We're, we're, we're going to try it out. Tarmogoyf. No, I'm just kidding. That guy's terrible. I don't hate this Nissa, but I don't think we'd play it main deck. Nothing really else for us, anyway. I have a request for the slap step. Instead of every one damage, it's every time you take damage. Alright, that's a little better. What if yeah. they attack for like 13? That's only one slap. You can slap me really hard. <laughs> okay, what if we slap based on the amount of damage? Sure. One damage is a light slap. Ten damage is a, a, a pretty hard slap. I like Acidic Slime. Do I like it better than Carnage Tyrant or Duplicant? I don't know. What do you think? Can we fit any of them in our deck? I don't know. I don't know. It's probably Acidic Slime. It's pretty good with Green Sun, yeah. Yeah, it's pretty good. Harmonize. I like Kiora, too. I don't think we're playing blue. I don't think we have to. You're right. I don't think we can. I'll put a harmonize in here. Exactly. Well, that's a good one. Also, let's just splash blue if we want. Okay. Man, this is the good Nissa, too. Dang, untapping four forests is huge. Yeah. It's probably better than the Razor Roof Stick. We've got one green card in the main deck. I don't actually think we need this card. We can actually put this in the sideboard for now. And just know we have a nice little white package in there. I think it's actually Nissa. It's like they're not even trying here. We'll take out the Absence Pokemon and board that guy in over one of these if we if we need it. This is slightly better elf, so. Look at this. Our entire sideboard is white or green. I see a red card, though. Except for that one red card. Why, well, Bob? As far as I know, I don't think you get to search for Delirium because when the spell is on the stack and resolving, you no longer have Delirium. All right. I think we can take this. This is any permanent, though. This kills anything. Yeah, I wouldn't cut that. Fertile Ground? Because we have a Rampant Growth now? Sure. Yeah, I like Fertile Ground coming out. One more cut. Actually, that's pretty good. I think we can live with that. I like that Ulamog at 10 is put after Green Sun Zenith, which is an X spell. That's interesting. Um, we can Dramoka that Kukush. <laughs> yeah, you know, I guess we could do that. I don't know what that means, but yeah, I, I imagine that's a possibility. What are you thinking? I don't know. This is tough. Might be Wood Elves. I think we board uh, Wood Elves in if we... Like, we don't need a three-mana guy. Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, I think that's fine. We'll play this guy, we'll play this guy, and we'll play a bunch of forests. Done. Brow. You hear that cat? And yeah, he's been fed. He's, yeah, he's nothing to complain about anymore. Yeah, he still is. 
Actually, is Bird just worse than Findhorn Elves here? Yeah. I'd rather have the 1-1 one, one because it can attack with the... Well, I guess they can, they can both attack with Sword, but... 1-1 one, one is just better than an 0-1, right? Correct. The 0-1 does fly, though, so if we put, a, we put a sword on this, it's much better in the air. But if there's no sword, the 1-1's better. This also lets us activate things if we steal them from our opponent. I don't know how we do that, though. Do we steal anything? No. We're not blue. Jerome Chris does say target player Saxon enchantment, yes. Yeah, we're gonna go bird. I like bird better. Everybody heard b -b about the bird, b -b -b bird. Yeah, we've definitely been in situations where we need to chump block like a Kaiga or something, so. I will play first. Anyway, this is a little slow. This is a slow boy, but I think you keep it. It's rough. Yeah, we got turn three play. <laughs> That's what you want in cube, but two two on turn three. What could go wrong? All right, that's fine. I don't care about that. It's basically like they did nothing. It's the final mic down. Are you dying? Maybe. That literally sounds like you're dying. Oh, turn two, that is. Hey. Swing batter. This is actually very good. Now we get to turn three harmonize. I mean, we're taking a lot of damage, but this might have single-handedly changed my mind on Ancient Tomb. <laughs> it's pretty broken. Which is kind of funny, I guess. Who shut down by the wall moments. Yeah, attacking wasn't really where I was going with that, so. Alright, lands, we get it. We're gonna have to discard something. Oh god. Gross. I mean you go to acidic slime next turn, right? You heard MTG Bot got banned today? What? Apparently MTG Bot on Twitch was permanently suspended through Twitch. I'm investigating now and I'll follow up with Twitch just three hours ago. Oh my god. Huh. What? Why? That sucks. Weird. I am not thrilled about that. One, two, three, four, five. If we ramp and growth, we can Karn next turn. Doesn't that seem good? Seems pretty decent. We could also Acidic Slime this turn, but that does not allow us to Karn next turn. I don't think we need to do that either. It is the final countdown. Yeah, that's really disappointing, actually. Why would they do that? I don't know. I'm going to get a hold of Dan and be like, what's going on, buddy? Oh, wow. Brutso Toots. Oh, that's interesting. Hmm. I'm intrigued. Yeah, I'm not blocking that. Four, five, six. We are one land away from both Karn, Hornet Queen, and Flipping Nissa. Has everybody heard about the bird? Ba -ba -ba bird, 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 ba -ba -ba bird's the word. They also missed the land drop, so I think actually, uh, did they miss the land drop actually? No, they didn't. Dang. I 
Oh, they're sure tapping the right ones every turn. That's interesting. This is hard to deal with. Oh, never mind. We good. Hmm. Well, let's flip you. Primeval Titan. Not exactly the same. Not the same. It is not the same. I think we just kill the Elspeth here? Because she can kill our Nyssa? We we'll probably do it before they activate her. Right. I just want to do it in their turn so they can't attack with the beast token. See you later. Bye. Just that, huh? I accept. Yeah, that's fine. I'll go to one. I just want the cards anyway. Did they do anything cool? Uh, they played a coalition relic. So no. No is the answer to that. Okay. Does Nissa count for one? I guess we'll find out here, right? Oh, I'm so dumb. Actually, it's still fine, but that was still dumb. I forgot about Thalia. Bzz, bzz. Oh, they all come in to play tapped. Oh, God. This Thalia is really obnoxious, man. Are all Thalias? I guess so. Uh, I imagine her casting cost is two in green still. I think that's how it works now. I don't know. Did they not add a add a counter with the coalition relic? They did. Puts trigger ability on the stack. And they didn't do anything. That's weird. Why are you going face with this guy? I'm confused. Are you going to Wrath of God here? Probably. what we figured let's play around the days or the force spike or both might want to get rid of that Johnny oh yeah that's the plan bang but da but da Water Sports Drew, what's going on, buddy? Welcome to the YouTube video. Oh, Monastery Butt Tour. Yeah, I was hoping it wasn't a forest, but... What do we get? A Supreme Verdict? Bokeh. Bokeh. This guy's wrath and supreme verdict. Man, they are ready for the for the creatures. I feel like we made a lot of mana here. We did. Do I just play sword here? Nah, we can wait. Can we? Yeah. We can wait? Yeah. You don't right. have to, but we can. I don't really want to take two just to play sword. 
Frank, you might keep me company all day while I work from home due to the storm here. Sounds like the same thing as planned. Nice. Glad to hear it, buddy. Okay. Four dudes. Sure. I am also sad the 60 card green deck didn't do better. Something happened. Ilmquist, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome to the Soul Tie Bruderuski. Can Karn survive this? Only time will tell. Are you going to throw your Monastery Mentor into my Karn? I don't know. No way. Cracking a fetch. Boy, they have one card in hand. What could it be? Did you check out Electir's Sweet Rakdos Control Deck? I did, actually. It's on my desktop right now. All this is fine. It's annoying, but fine. They really went wide here. Yeah, they did. Yeah, they did. Yeah, here's <laughs> Oh, boy. One, two, three. So we can just go block here, block here. Rough. For Phyllis, it doesn't really matter. We can trade with Mentor, block Monk. Karn goes to four. Yeah, that's fine. That's actually a very good draw. I see you need to equip here. They get one card, so. Oh, dang. How can I share a picture with us? Um, You could send it to me through Twitch, like upload it to Imager and then just, really? Wow. That's pretty good. Just sacrifice this guy? Probably not, because we have like Wulamog in our deck. So we can exile the Oblivion and get it back. That's fine. Yeah, just swing with those guys. Come on, something good. That counts. That'll do. God, we never take a picture of our deck. What's the biggest thing in our deck right now? Baleth, I think. Baleth is good, but Primal Titan's probably just better, if, if that's the case, right? Sure. Bert. Sure, Bert. <laughs> oh, God. I'm actually going to take two here. Actually, no, I'm not. Yeah, we don't need to, right? I don't know if we need to. I want to equip it too. I guess we can we can use we can use all our mana and then if we have to equip we can. Right. Well this is for nine, right? No, I mean for nine. We need to do it for we six. Six, yeah. Yeah, that's fine. It could have been a Tarka, you were not wrong. Do we miss anything? Ulamog. Our, our deck is literally Ulamog, Tooth and Nail, and five forests now. Now it's Ulamog, Forest, and... Ulamog, Tooth and Nail, and three forests. Wish I could flip this Garrick face up. This guy's not connecting, so that's that's fine. All right, we're in top deck mode. Only we have a primeval titan and a sword of body and mind. Famous last words. But it is cube, so anything could happen. Like that. Well, that is a blue permanent. What was that? Why did they... They attacked and then conceded. That was interesting. I guess we could actually put the sword on titan, and that's pretty insane, right? Trample and pro blue. 
Yeah. I mean, hey. we're just going to draw an overgrown battlement. That's not scary, right? <sighs> this seems good, actually, because they do have Oblivion Ring. Jess. Jace? Jess. Oh, Jace. Yes. Oh, Jace. Yes. Dear God, I think he's broken. All right, so we got Verdon, we got Temple Garden. We'll bring in Avacyn's Pilgrim over Lenoir Elves. And we got Birds, and we got Pilgrim, and we got High Arc, and we got Rampa Growth. Yeah, this is actually Rampa Growth. Don't we want planes? We could also switch Rampa Growth for Wood Elves, but I don't know if that's better. Might be better actually. I kind of like that better. They're both getting a land out, but this is actually a creature too. And you don't have to have a planes in your deck. I also kind of like Jermoka here too. Wow, I can't believe MTG bot is suspended. I'm like, what is that about, dude? Could. Yeah. Good good point. I didn't think about that. I don't know what you're doing right now. We Neither gotta... do I. All right. Well, let me know if you figure it out. I never. Moonscone, eight months in a row. Thank you, buddy. Really appreciate it. What are we cutting, man? Garrick Rollins? I don't know. Thrankers? Sure. That ain't good. I don't know. What do you do when all your cards are good? I don't know. Little discover? No, Battlement. Yeah, I was thinking Battlement. I'll just go 41. Okay. Hunter goes crazy all the time. Okay, so Ludus Games, I actually, I, st I just saw your, uh, here, I'll put it on the, I'll put it on the thing, because it's actually pretty funny. There you go. This is what, this is what he was trying to show me. <laughs> it's pretty epic. Well, you know what they say, there was a sweat, and then the epic. <laughs> so, did you see that quote? Did you see it again? The sweat and the epic? Yeah. I mean, not recently. You ready? That's so. There epic. was a sweat, and then the epic. That was that was a very good game. <laughs> there was That's a old. sweat, and then the epic. That's when I have my old hairdo. All right, I'm gonna keep this hand. Maybe we'll draw one drop, a toasty little one drop. There was a sweat, and then the epic. <laughs> There was a sweat, and then there was an epic. Like you do. That Mike B, he's more ice than water, if you know what I mean. <laughs> I think I do. All right, one drop. Damn it. Dang it, Dick. Why are you like this? We'll draw next turn. Yeah, we will, actually. Avacyn's Pilgrim on the top. Land schmacks. Classic. Classic Vlasic pickles. I swear to God, I live in a simulation. I swear to God. I, it has never been more clear to me that I live in a simulation. That's the way it goes, Mr. Anderson. Could have been birds. Could have been tree speaker. Could have been Finhorn elves. Could have been any other card in the deck. It was the literal one card I said. 
It's going to be Avacyn's Pokemon top anyway. <laughs> I don't under I don't actually understand it. I'm actually uncomfortable right now. Hit your window with a wrench. <laughs> wow, they just stole my guy. Why don't you have a soul? Do we play Pilgrim here? We got Scotty Pilgrim into into Whisperwood, right? I guess. Which is just better than Anissa into nothing. I don't understand how that happened. I really don't. Are you going to just kill my guy? Wow, a bold strategy, Cotton. Although I do like a Johnny being at one, so that's okay. You know what? I ain't even gonna risk a daze. I got I got better things to do with my time than be getting dazed on. Although this a Johnny is problematic because now we don't get we get we have to wait two turns to play a Whisperwood. Dr. Armadillo PhD, what should you make for dinner? That is a hard question to answer because I have no idea what you have access to right now. Oh, the old Johnny into Elspeth again. Classic. Somebody touch my spaghetti. That was a good draw. I guess if you want to kill that with uh, Johnny, you're welcome to. Gets rid of one planeswalker. Well, planeswalkers keep on rolling. <laughs> keep on rolling. Is it bring your son to stream day? Yeah, it's always bring your son to stream day. Sometimes he just plays hooky. Sometimes. I'm still extremely uncomfortable with that happens in the ballroom. It's not an okay thing to have happen. It happens way too frequently is really what I'm saying. Oh, they're just going to kill this guy normally. They're going to oblivion ring Ruffellos. Are you just going to give me Ruffellos? Whew. The lack of respect you have is Ooh. unbelievable right now. Ooh. Five. We have 11 mana right now. Wow. 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 So we can Primal Titan and Harmonize. We could just Hornet Queen. Oh, that guy. Oh, that. Yeah, that's good too. Oh, well, now we have to flip Nissa. Nope. Oh, no, you're good. What happened? Never mind. What were you thinking? I was thinking we didn't have a white source yet, but we do. So. Boy, I always, I be, I, be, I stay having white sources. What's your morph? Karn. Oh, that's sad. Oh, all right, cool. I don't care about that. Also, I do like having Whisperwood out because then we can just be like, Whisperwood. For what? Uh, sacrifice it so that we don't die to, uh, like, Supreme Verdict or Wrath of God. Oh, yeah. Also, we have Harmonized Thragtail's Corner Queen in hand, like... Our, if they want to wipe the board, our recovery is pretty good. They do get to kill Nissa though, but whatever. Okay, so you're clearly not playing Wrath of God. Sure. Wog. Damage feels no like wog today. Damage feels like it's already done though. Sure, Mr. Anderson. <laughs> That's from the Matrix. Oh no, I didn't I quoted it earlier and had no idea. Did you quote it earlier? I did. What was your quote? When you said you were in a simulation, I said something about Mr. Anderson. Did you really? Yeah. I just randomly said that at the, I didn't hear that at all. Oh. 
That's weird. This night's getting weirder and weirder. Yeah, I had I heard nothing about the simulation I, is real. This is really awkward. I'm very I'm very weirded out by this entire stream so far. This is a scary number. I'm not really. Oh, I like this because we can actually sacrifice this to uh, to counter the spell because it only has one target. Oh, target player controls. No, it doesn't actually. That's cool. That's weird. I don't know why it's target player and not creatures you control, but so be it, I guess. That's actually very good. That's exactly what we needed to knock Elspeth down to size. Why is this guy highlighted in the graveyard? Why not? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So you can actually triple block, but that's up to you. I guess we'll just get Forest Nykthos. Oh, they can't troll block. They got pro blue. That's a good point. You are a smart dude. Apparently, I don't know how magic works. Yeah, everybody knew that. Wow. All right, that's a good. That's going to be a good turn. That ought to do. As long as, as long as we don't die here, I think we're okay. What do we take? Three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. We actually take a bunch. We have seven. Oh wow! If they if you keep my Rafelos untapped, boy, we get to do it all. Oh my God! We get to fight something too. I feel I feel fine just taking six here actually. Oh, God. Woo. No nimble obstructionist. I guess we're good to go. What are we? Seven, eight. We get eight mana here. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20 mana. It's a good amount. It's, uh, it's not bad. We actually get 21 if we play a Thrag Tusk. <laughs> we even get more than that if we play Hornet Queen. As long as we play the Ulan Log. I do like starting with Dramoka, though. That's a good call. So we go from three to six. Yeah, so we net we net three there. One, two, three, four. Get rid of your super boys. Don't have nimble obstructionist. You did not. This is also indestructible. Don't care about your other things. Probably just move the sword. I was just going to play Thrag Tusk. That also works. I mean, if they Supreme Verdict or, like, wipe the board or something, it's just fine. And we gain an extra five, so we actually gain three there. Okay. Seven mana. Sinks Rave? What? Sinks Rave? They already played that. Oh. Did they forget they played it? <laughs> I thought it was in my hand. Uh, nope, just gonna pass. Oh, I think I guess they thought we're at okay. I have no idea then. That's weird. Yeah, so I mean, if they if they want to wipe the board, we get a Lotus Cobra, we get a 3 3, and we get to keep an Ulamog. Seems good. If they don't want to wipe the board, then they're probably dead. It's a worm boy, sure. One worm boy. Who would win? 
one worm boy. Oh, it might have been okay. Well, it might have been Cyclonic Rift, and they just couldn't cast it because of. Oh, they, it doesn't matter. I guess they were trying to cast something, and they couldn't because of Ulamog, or because of Dramoka, rather. Yeah. All right. This deck seems pretty solid. I'm okay with it. Sarite. I mean, I can't think of a reason why they wouldn't have cast it on our turn, though, right? Like, it could have also been Secure the Wastes, actually. That's true. I think they just probably realized that they uh, they were probably going to Secure the Wastes. They realized the better play on their turn, since they couldn't Secure the Wastes due to Dramoka, was Worm Coil Engine. And then they realized one attack with Ulamog just kills them anyway, so. That's my, that's my prediction. How about you? You all right, man? How did you wake up today? Let's see. 345, something like that. What time did you go to bed? Uh, like 3 a.m., something like that. Why do you need 13 hours of sleep? Why not? That's not an answer, though. You kept this hand? Yeah. It's terrible. This hand is great. Every card we draw is going to be good. It's not. Absence Pilgrim off the top. Why would you want that? I'm, I don't. I'm just saying it's going to be there. Ready? It's a little better. You ain't wrong. Two elf boys. Actually, I could have played both, right? I could have went land this, this guy, play the land. Yeah, I could have played both. I'm just bad. Don't care. Shame well, we me if you that. want. Shame me for not playing both if you want. My haste got the better of me. Abrupt decay. Oh, my guy's better. Beep. Beep. I'm sorry, what was that? Beep. Okay. Oh, uh, we can't play a land and it, though. Yeah, you're right. I still think we should jam that, though. Yeah? Yeah. I'd rather, I always rather get a guy out of it. So you want to just Cobra this turn? Yeah, it's probably just Cobra attack with these guys. All right. He also might let his guard down, because he's like, she didn't have anything to do with the mana. I feel like he had a removal spell, though. You would have used it. What if they had a three or four mana removal spell? Uh, Cobra wouldn't have done it, though. That wouldn't have done anything, because we still have to play a land to get the extra mana from Cobra. True. I mean, we could go Cobra now, play a land, add three, four, five. It's still not enough. That doesn't... None, none of what you guys are saying is correct. You guys are all wrong. All wrong. I say you slam with those two wood boys and play land and pass. Can't you play Bayloth this turn? Yeah, of course we can. I just don't. I never like playing Bayloth without getting a four four out of it. I'd rather just play it next turn and get a four four out of it because then you're, it's more like a broodmate dragon. I'd rather wait than give them an opportunity to kill it, getting no value out of it because that's just so much worse for the Cobra or for the uh, the Bayloth. Green. So we got a green. One, two, three, four, five, six. We can actually play Bailoff now, but I just don't care. Not that I don't care, I just don't want to. I'd rather not expose it. Of course, if they have Languish here, it's just terrible. Yeah, that'd be really bad. Or Damnation, I guess. I don't know if they're both in the cube, but... They probably are. I think they both are. Here we go. Oh, that's not either of them. Oh, there's a little cutie. Oh, they're going to do it. They're going to Vendillion click us. Okay. So long, Bayloths. I hardly knew you. It's got to be Bayloths. It's not even close. Then we're just going to draw Primeval Titan, so it'll be okay. Magic wants to replace one six drop with another, right? Sure. Oh! <laughs> you dummy! Well, to be fair. You dummy. So, play Forest. 
Do we could play Nykthos, which is going to add four. So we'll have one, two, three, four, five mana, because this adds one more than it takes to use. Six, seven, eight, nine, plus the one from Cobra, we'll have ten. All right. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, God, I'm so sorry. I'm not. Sorry, not sorry. So, Ulamog Prime Time. I was gonna say Prime Time or Paging Veil, so we can get a bunch of cuties. I think it's. I think Ulamog's just better. Okay. Do you not think Ulamog's just better? I mean, if they probably, have Damnation, like we just get the human Ulamog, right? That's true. I mean, we could have also just put Thrag Tusk into play and cast Ulamog next turn. Yeah, that might have been better. Maybe. Doesn't matter. We win the game. Thanks for... This is why... Okay, no, this is completely... Um, what's, what's the word I'm looking for? It's completely results-oriented, but that is actually why I dislike Vandalian Click. Because you take away something, like, you're like, oh, let me take away this card. And, like, you take away something good, you're taking away Rampaging Bailoth or, like, a Remand or a Path to Exile or something, but, like, they could just get something so much better than that. Serious question, what did the fish say when it hit the wall? I couldn't I tell you. I don't know either. I don't even think that's a serious question. Keep on rocking. Damn. Yeah, all right. Oh, boy. Is that a fish joke? Yeah. Here we go again with another try. Hopefully no flyers so we don't have to die. The Hulk is less green than we are tonight, and we will fill opponent with all time all time fright. Let's have a draft and we slap Mike all day. <laughs> oh god. He'll be so slapped you will never find the way. Take all enemies to the woods with prime time. Now I'm too tired to rhyme. So a good night. I wish people in chat and the deck looks great. Let's leave it at that. Zaxar, have a good night, buddy, if you're if you're if you're peacing out. Did we bring anything in? We saw like two cards. We saw literally top and Vendillion click. Yep. That was a good that was a good game. We had a good fun, good clean game of magic there. Let's do it again. You like this hand? Is it keepable? The boys are back in town. Tonight there's gonna be a jailbreak. Tonight, there's gonna be a jailbreak. Where do you think that jailbreak's gonna be, man? Somewhere in the town. God, I knew it. Get in there. Get that point in there. Next turn, it's gonna be a little awkward. Why? Because we can't tooth and nail and twine. We can only tooth. We can only tooth. <laughs> We can only tooth. We can't nail. <laughs> How do you know we're not nailing and not toothing? Because the tooth is when you see it. The nail is when it goes in. None of this sounds good. No? There's no way he survives anyway, so... Roses are red. This deck is green. A turn four Ulamog really is mean. Wow. Oh, boy. What up, Papa Perky? Papa Perky? Are you, what are you doing? You're just sitting there with your head on the microphone? What are you doing, man? Don't mind me. I do mind you. Why? Because you're a weirdo. You're a dang weirdo. So? What is job? this? Beast within my Rafellos? Okay. Okay. Joke's on you. We aren't going to do anything with it anyway. Yeah, you dummy. One, two, three. We have six mana next turn. That's pretty good. Mike B., are you sad today? I'm sad every day. 
Wow. We could beast within our own token. Could do that. We could. Can I have this guy? No? You want to dismiss it? Oh, my boy. It's my boy. He's not your boy today. He's not my boy. He's a traitor. Traitor boy. Rafellos always has a beast within him. All that sauntering was to cover up his sadness. <laughs> That's my secret. I'm always a beast. Why would I shame scoop there? It was a Wood Elves. If they want to counter a Wood Elves with Mystic Snake. Sure. Total Dashy Larry. Oh my god. Those are some solid gentlemen. Solid gentles. Solid lentils. I just beast within the Ashiok. That seems good. Actually, my opponent is playing Mystic Snake and Ashiok, which makes me feel like I should be playing. I should actually just scoop. Tonight there's gonna be a Mike B. Somewhere in the town. No one knows for sure, though. But somewhere. But the some way. What do we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight mana next turn. If we can draw Ancient Tomb, we got gas in the tank, boys. We both have two cards, but I feel like our board is better, and our hand is probably better. Probably Robly. Probably Robly. Probably Robly. Hey Mike, I'm laying in bed eating Flaming Hot Cheetos watching you on stream. How does that make you feel? Also, how do Flaming Hot Cheetos rank on your chips list and what's your favorite chip? <laughs> um, That's a lot to unpack there. It doesn't there. really make me feel any certain type of way. Doesn't make you feel some type of way? Uh, as far make as, feel some as type ranking of way. chips, um, I don't know. I'd say they're up there. Maybe top 10s. You think Hot Flaming Hot Cheetos are top 10? I think so for chips. What about top five? No way. Interesting. That's actually pretty good because now we get to kill their swamp and it puts them one mana further away from their Nissa. And Acidic Slime also puts us up to the enough mana to tooth and nail with Entwine next turn. So this has actually worked out pretty well. Oh, you're going to. I think a top in response, sure. So now we have one, two, and this activates for one, two, three, four, five, and then we have ten. All right, that's pretty good. Hey, that's pretty good. Instead of eight. All right. Instead of eight. I don't like you. What's your top five chips? What's your number one chip? Number one chip? Yeah, man. <sighs> I think it might be jalapeno chips. Really? Yeah. Like like kettle corn kettle corn ones. Kettle corn baked. That's not what it is. I feel like nothing you're saying is actually Kettle English. corn kettle corn chips with jalapeno. Are they kettle flavoring. cooked? Kettle corn? Kettle cooked. Yeah, <laughs> kettle cooked chips that are jalapenos. Kettle corn chips. Or maybe the sriracha honey ones. Those are good too. Make me feel some type of way. What's a real? Wow, pro green seems great on this board. Holy smokes. I mean, I'm just going to play this, but do they have a counter spell, you think? Hmm, I wonder. We have wasabi five, burritos? Six, nine, 10, 11. Burrito. I said burritos. Doritos. I didn't know they had a wasabi flavor. Not not paying spells, not paying costs, not paying costs, not paying costs. Oh, it's just Digging. sitting. They just sit on the top there. That's cute. Or they're just trying to. No, they did. No, that's unfortunate. Sure. Well, looks like we've been bested. Bested? Yeah. 
I mean, they're just going to draw top. We have Sword of Body and Mind against the deck with z literal zero uh, things to thing. We'll probably just kill it. Kill what? I'll just counterspell it. That was really sad. You're really sad. Why don't they just draw the dissipate instead of drawing instead of leaving it on top so they have to draw the stupid top every turn? That seems worse to me. They're worried about the mono green decks, Thoughtseize. <laughs> I have to protect it. Sure. I think they're just they're just dead to this, right? Yeah, probably. Let's see if this still adds five. Oh, it adds one less because that's not considered a permanent. That's interesting. So if we play this, though, and we don't hit a land, we can't sort of body and mind, which is pretty sad. If we do hit a land, I want this guy in play first, so it's, it's actually a tricky situation. Pretty sneaky, sis. Oh, my God. Actually, we play oh, this guy sort first. Sort of body and mind and kill them. No, we play this first, and then we get two extra with the... We get two extra with Nykthos. See what's happening right now? I'm so confused. Why are you confused about? Why are you putting on the Death Touch guy? Because nothing else can attack. Oh, this guy can attack, I guess, but I didn't see that guy because it was on the right of the, fuck, the newly played guy. So, didn't really make a lot of sense to me, I guess. Okay. As long as you have a reason. I'm the reason for the season, bro. What do you have a... Oh. <laughs> you just looked. You just looked at him. This is why people don't like tops. Because it's like, you just looked, buddy. You should remember. Well, the situation has changed. I'm just going to mill them anyway. Why even do that? You got an Emrakul, the Promised End. You got a Nyssa, a Coalition Relic. A Vraska. Why wouldn't you top after I mill you? Doesn't that seem better? Just a tad bit. All right, just checking. Just checking. How come the Death Touch didn't kill him? That's weird, man. Hmm. That is weird. I don't get it. Magic complicated. Here we go again. I'm just going to auto-yield to this because I don't care about hitting OK every single time. How many... Uh tabletop magic players do you think or like kitchen top players think death touch actually does that i have to say not a lot no birds what's going on buddy hi i'm gonna run to the surface with chocolate need me to grab you anything yeah um mike is a big fan of uh kettle cooked chips so if you want to grab him some of those that's he'd appreciate it i would appreciate that how do we how is that Uzi even able to hold the sword suspension of disbelief shattered Oh, they get their Nissa. No, he's got arms. Look. Michael, we both know he doesn't have any arms. No, man, look. Ari won the match. The fact your son doesn't think Doritos make top five really makes me think this whole channel. I agree with you. Oh, God, what's going to happen? What are you clipping? What's your top five chips? What's your number one chip? Number one chip? Yeah, man. I think it might be jalapeno chips. Really? Yeah. Like like kettle corn kettle corn ones. Kettle corn <laughs> baked. That's not what it is. I feel like nothing you're saying is actually Kettle English. corn kettle corn chips with jalapeno. Are they kettle flavor. cooked kettle corn? Kettle cooked. Yeah, <laughs> kettle cooked chips that are jalapenos. <laughs> kettle corn chips. <laughs> or maybe the sriracha honey ones. Those are good too. It's much funnier when you rewatch it. <laughs> Kettle corn chips. I actually do like the way they, they label these clips. Secret of Strong Guanaco Vote Yeah. That's that's good. I, I totally should have read that and then I would have known. Ooh. I don't know why it was so much funnier watching it the second time. 
I think it's because how ridiculous I said it. I think it's because you said kettle corn like 15 times, and then you're like, no, that's not right. And then you still keep saying kettle corn. I'll keep this hand. It's got green soul ring and Denissa. Look at all these. chip number one. That's we got, fair. We got a bunch of strong, powerful green ladies. I think it might be jalapeno chips. Really? Yeah. Like like kettle corn kettle corn ones. Kettle corn baked. That's not what it is. I feel like nothing you're saying is actually kettle corn English. kettle corn chips with jalapeno. <laughs> Are they kettle- <laughs> Just keep saying kettle corn. Kettle corn. Kettle, kettle, kettle corn. Kettle, no, kettle, that's kettle, not kettle. what it is. Kettle corn. You say no, that's not what it is, and then you just go back to saying kettle corn again. I'm like, what part of the chip is the corn, do you think? Old Dutch kettle crunch jalapeno cheddar. That sounds like a real chip. Is that a real chip? It sounds delicious. What do you think the odds are this guy gets disfigured? None. Zero odds. I'm going to attack because that's worth more to me than putting a... Than floating two mana for no reason? Yeah. Well, no, you can level it up again. Because maybe at level five, Nissa can tap for a mana. I suppose... This is just busted, though, right? Like, turn two, turn three, six, turn three. Yeah, killing your badlands, like that's pretty good. <laughs> Did this game just oh, what? Did they just have six their turn? No, you. Wow this this draft has gone well. Let's say that I guess. I've got a kettle corn. Can you milk me, Greg? Four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh my god, we're so close. Meanwhile, in their turn, I've only got two beta. I've played an island. We're trying to figure out if we can if we can uh Ulamog here. Oh boy, kettle corn, Michael. Kettle corn. So five, six, seven, eight, nine. We are we are on the verge, my friend. Bad co- All right, that was the end, I guess. All right, that was. Uh, both teams played hard. We haven't seen anything again, so. Nope. Uh, This this stream sponsored by uh, jalapeno cheddar kettle corn kettle chip kettle bake chip corn kettle chips. I'm surprised you didn't mention your jalapeno children. <laughs> <laughs> got him. Oh my god, jalapeno children. Yeah, they're really something, aren't they? They're special. They definitely are. I will keep this hand as well. Wow, turn to Oracle Moldia. Yeah. Ancient Tomb OP, dude. Told you. I was... You're like, oh, we gotta take some damage. Oh, oh they mulled a five on little, the play, too? My little fingers can't... Oh, the damage. Oh. What happened? What do my fingers have to do with the damage? <laughs> I, I don't know. Do you want to draft the next one? Like, the whole thing? Yeah, man. Uh, What about a stip? Do we have any stips laying around that we need to do? Any stips laying around? I wanted to play this guy first, but it doesn't let us play turn two Oracle, so I didn't. Dark Ritual. Oh, God. Oh, God. That's aggressive. That is aggressive, but so is a Karn. So is that guy. He's actually not very aggressive. He's pretty slow. Very aggressive. They also have two cards in their hand. So mulliganing into Dark Ritual for Xena Blair is pretty good. If we can, if we have land land off the top, we actually get to play uh, Karn and exile the the obliterator, which is pretty sick. There's one. Oh dang! Just primeval titan, I guess. Drats. Pretty sneaky. Drats. Sis. 
And we get another one. Wow. All right. I guess we take five more and then never have to worry about damage again because we can Ulamog next turn. Yep. One, two, three. This is going to make one, two, three, four, five. So five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Okay. And they have two cards in hand, so I'm not terribly afraid. Yeah, definitely not blocking them. Sacrifices and experiments. I'll go to six here and hope I don't die. Okay, that's actually to totally okay. Totes okay. So we can play Nissa, right? And then we'd have four, five, six, seven. Yeah, we have way more, and and we can still play a land. Activate the Nick those before you play a land. Yeah. And then we could actually get land off the top as well. So. Okay, so Nick those for four. Flip. Do we have four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten? We can actually just play Wilmog here. We go to Let's four, that. but. That's fine. That does seem fine. This is when we're getting rid of the red source. I feel like these games have gone well. I don't know. Maybe it's me. Maybe it's Maybelline. Get to play another land, and that's it. Okay. Good lord. <laughs> well, they had three lands in play. We got rid of the red source so that hopefully they can't burn us out. Yeah, I don't think that's going to do it. You might say that does nothing. It does nothing. You done messed up, A.A. Ron! Oh, that's sad. You can never have this. You can never have this. Sorry about that shit deck you got there, boy. Is that what you said? Uh, no, no, that was not. That was not <laughs> it. Uh, can we kill them? I don't think so. I mean, we may not actually kill them this turn, but they're pretty. We can much put dead. them to one and exile a million cards in their library. Uh, do we have any? Anyway? Yeah, we can just Karn. We'll Karn to deal them. Oh, we got the Scarab God, Hostage Taker, Toxic Deluge. There's a Sweatin' in the Epic. Land. Land. Play Thrag Tusk to be safe. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, actually. This is all unnecessary. Do, 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 do. <laughs> All right, we good. Got him. Feel safe at seven. Oh, they have no cards left in hand. All right. I'm just going to make D-Face every single time. Do the last. Send Game a message. Blade. Doomblade. They don't have any cards in hand. Doomblade. They don't have a card. Doomblade. Doomblade. Boop. Got him. Got him. That deck was great. I, the green deck, finally worked out for us. 3-0. All mm -hmm. right, sweet. We're, we're, now we're collecting some trophies. Thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Slam those like and subscribe buttons, and I'll see you next time.